Hi, Mark Savage here. Welcome to my workshop. Still working on the YBR125. If you're a regular viewer, you've watched this one already. What's this one about today? A heat gun. This came to me and someone had tried to steal it, basically. They'd cut the electric start and they'd cut the ignition and all sorts of messes. I have just fitted ignition here, which you'll see in the other video, but I had to rewire a little bit. Let me show what I'm talking about. I had to completely rewire this and I've put a sleeve under here. Um, so if you're ever going to get a Chinese ignition, a cheap job, be careful because the wires were all wrong. So marry up to what you had before. But here's the sleeving and underneath there I've connected all the wires and connected that there. And here's one where you tried to cut it. So I'm going to see whether this heat shrink works rather than using green or black tape. I thought I'd use the heat shrink. It looks a lot, lot smarter and more professional. But the ignition is in. Now... A really good tip before you heat shrink anything is to test. When I connected these wires in, I could see, well, they're just cheap. The red was in here, and yet I looked on my one, the red wasn't. So I chanced it, I plugged it in, bang, the fuse blew. And it would really. If it's not fused, it would really cause some damage. However, I rewired it, and I've tested it, and if we do this now, light works. She starts. I'm not going to do it because I've already done it, but she starts. So, what's in the pack? Don't know yet, I haven't opened it. They come in all sorts of prices and depend what you want, really. I mean, the 2000 watts, you know, I'm just using it for heat shrinking. So, I wasn't particularly worried. And the only one I really wanted was this one, which I'm going to curl up a little bit more. I don't burn anything when I blow that, and that should do it. Let's have a go. A bit of a mess my workshop for a minute. I do say put things away, don't I? Let's get these away. That's better. Knife. Always hand over a torch. The rest is work in progress, except these. Don't forget to get that on there as well. It's the main nut, this is. Mushroom, I'm going to get that on there, mustn't I? Right, I'll put that on in a second. Haven't tightened it down yet. Anyway, we're not doing that, we're doing this. There you go. Instructions, how hard can it be? Turn on, turn off. Tell you what though, nice big lead with this. I do hate the ones you get like half an inch of a lead and you've got to then use extension lead, but say mustn't do. Oh, look at that, that's a nice lead that is. Right, plug in. I suspect it'd be quite The attachment on which doesn't fit tighten up a little bit there we go right should we have a go never done this before let's see what it does wow <laughs> i mean that's what you call shrunk let's have another go you ready Look at that. Almost looks professional, doesn't it? I haven't turned it up full heat. Oh, look at that. Okay, a bit of a smell. 15 pounds. That looks better than any amount, any amount of tape you could put on there will never look as good as that. So for me, that's well worth it. This little kit, four pounds. It's got all the sleeves. I bought another one as well with different colours. That was eight pounds and that was a 460 piece set. So for 15, 30 quid under 30 quid, that looks really good and I'm really happy. It's sealed quite nicely and waterproof as well. Well, for moisture proof. That one's really good. No more she's going to get in there, and it works, and it doesn't look tacky, does it? You know, if you'd put, I know I wouldn't use green, if you put tape around it, I don't think it looks anywhere near as good. So, not particularly branded, just the fact to get a heat gun, and you do get some other little attachments, which I'm looking for now because I'm daft. Here we go, some other little attachments. I suppose I'd better show them. I don't know. Reducing maybe into small areas. 
and I think, and maybe that for stickers on your bike. I mean, I've often had stickers, and they've got to peel them off and use petrol. Maybe this gets them off really well. Idiot. So for the heat gun, making a much nicer job of that. Really happy for a very small amount of money. Please like, subscribe, check out my videos. Maybe watch the one of this actually running and looking better now. I've got 300 odd videos, but like, subscribe, share, and I'll be happy. Cheers.